Okay, so today we are going to swim with dolphins. We're so excited, but I think we're all a little nervous. It's one thing to see them, but it's another thing to get into the water with them. There's a little bit of anxiety, I think. We have been relaxing all morning. As Chelsea said last night, we need a chill day. She's right, we need a day where we do this big fun excursion and then relax. And if someone come down to the pool here, they can come to the pool. If someone to go shopping, I'm willing to go shopping with them. We're gonna take it easy, but first, we're gonna head over and swim with dolphins. It's gonna be really fun. Do you know I'm looking and I can't help but smile? Do you know how much I love you? You put my favorite song on, I put my feet up, and we just sing along, and I can't help but feel it. Just loving this moment, can we stay here forever? I don't know. When I dance around, I can't help but feel All right, unfortunately we can't take our GoPro in and I'm so sad. I'm like seriously so sad. Luckily I did pay for the photographer so we get photos. So you're just gonna have to get a photo montage. I'm really upset. I wish they would just let us take our GoPro in. <sighs> so frustrated because even if it would mean that whole person wouldn't be able to get in and then even then you wouldn't be able to like zoom in enough to like really truly capture the experience. So I'm kind of bothered by that, not gonna lie. But we're gonna go and have the fun experience that we wanted to and then we will share with you all the fun things that we talked, you know, that we did and we'll talk about it and try and share the experience through photos as best we can. Now that we're kind of like full force like in videos, it's hard to have people tell me I can't do them. That's very frustrating. I don't wanna stay here, no. Ain't gonna keep it low now. If you wanna go, let's go. Let's wrap it up and hit the road. I just got an awesome vibe. Striking the wind of boats now. Liberty's on my mind. We've taken off, we've left the ground. You, you gotta understand that we get one chance, one chance. Yeah? Sure. You had a good time? You like... Did they feel way different than you thought they were going to feel? No. I expected them. You expected them to be like that? I it was pretty cool though. expected um, them not to like shed every two hours. You what was that, Ashley? They shed every two hours. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. So that's how they can rough and tumble and play with each other like we saw on the other side. Yeah. Right? They also heal really quickly. Yeah, they heal really quick and that skin sloughs off and reforms so that's I don't know, just, it's all really, really cool and interesting. I've always like, never wanted to be a dolphin trainer, but it's always, I'm always so curious about like how they train them. I guess that's what I'm curious about. So Jace, what was your thought on dolphins? It was awesome. You liked it? Oh, totally worth doing it. Dolphins feel like so cool. Right? So intelligent. Yeah, so tell them about that, uh, the repeat trick that they can do, that what that one dolphin can do. They do a signal and they, 
Oh, go ahead, you tell it. Go like, if you do like one signal, and then you go like One this. trick, right? Yeah, and then they come back to you, go like this, and they repeat it. But well, one of them does. One of them does it. Yeah. Yeah, they're super smart, aren't they? It's fun. You liked it? Yeah. What was the coolest thing about it for you? Getting to actually feel and see like the moves it does. Right, all the tricks? Yeah. Yeah? Just in general being. Yeah. Did you like kind of holding it and touching it? Because mm -hmm. didn't we, like, we got to see the grandma. Or, like, we got to see the dad, the mom, the mom and, and the baby. baby. And the grandma. Oh, the grandma oh yeah, and the grandma was the first one, right? Okay. So I want the, the grandma, the dad, the mom. And the yeah. baby. Yeah. Yeah. And then I think they rang. And we saw how the baby nurses, right? What was different about their tongue? Yeah, it's um, it. How they um, milk, they wrap it because there's like little spikes around. They wrap it around and make a little straw, kind of. And when they nurse, right? On mama? That's pretty cool. I didn't know that. Are you getting full? Are you getting enough fed? There's a cheese stick in there if you want it. Yeah. So we're just hanging out here by the pool. The older two are just laying out. Uh, Chelsea still has her ear infection, and so she's having a hard time being in the water. You're gonna go diving? You're gonna go diving? We're gonna go back here soon. What do you think? Should I get myself a little bucket hat? It's not fitting over my little ponytail in the back, but I am realizing I need a big hat. I got a, and a, and a bigger t-shirt to go over my shoulders. Look, you're meant, we got a medium. I know, they're I'm meant just. To, they're meant to go like this and like. And come down over your eyes. Yeah, but I just can't. Yep. For some reason, Ashley is big on these bucket hats and she wants to get another one and I want it to look like it came from Hawaii. She just keeps picking up random ones and I want it to look like cutesy Hawaii. They have them at home, like a lot of I know, them, but really I want you to look like you got it in Hawaii. Yeah. Yeah. I'm just gonna also look at like home because it's probably gonna be like other really ones. Cute ones. Yeah. Like. So, anyway, we're probably yeah. not gonna stay down here too long. Um, one, because I'm getting pretty red. And two, we need a little bit more food, so. I am the official narrator. <laughs> we are gonna go back to the room, change or clean up or get out of wet clothes. Hang on, waterfall. And then uh, Dad and Chelsea, I think are gonna stay in the hotel because her ear is still not fully recovered. We need to get another a full like 24, 30 hours with her medicine before it's gonna feel better to go swimming. As of right now, she can't really even like go underwater. It hurts too much. Then Kaylee, Abby, and I, and maybe Ashley, she hasn't decided, are gonna go shopping. We all need to find some kind of a sun hat. <laughs> we still are not even halfway through our trip. Well, I guess we're halfway through. But we have a lot of sightseeing to do we just need to kind of cover up. And uh, so, and Abby has found her sweatshirt she wanted to get. I need to get a sticker for a friend that collects Hawaiian stickers. And anything else that might float our boat Hawaiian style. Are you enjoying your time? Oh, it's great. Those dolphins are amazing. Yeah. Oh, wait. Oh. We don't need the train. No, we don't need the train. We haven't really shown too much of our in-room shenanigans. This one's having ice cream for lunch. <laughs> and I have no problem with it. I'm having some of our Panera mac and cheese, some apple juice, and some water right here. And I'm gonna go out there on the deck because I haven't eaten out there yet. All right, I will take mac and cheese with a view like that any day. All right, the girls and I are going to go over to King's shop 
and I have not driven the car yet, so I am getting used to this big, huge suburban. Alright, we struck out for a lot of the stuff we came for, but Kaylee found a cute sticker for her friend, and then Abby found at the Honolulu store, she found a nice hat like the perfect color of <laughs> every other store that has hats that have like the mesh in the back yeah walked in and this is the one they have and it's like perfect they had a bunch but yeah but she won't let me have a matching one <laughs> i've been i know you did find it first so i've been wanting one like that all right so we found this cute little jewelry store you want to show me your idea for your friends so it says close your eyes and make a wish then tie the bracelet on your wrist one that bracelet breaks into two the wish you made might just come true and she got three turtle ones in three different colors and it's for you and your two friends yeah that's cute all right abby's over here on a mission to get dole whip so Hopefully they're open. Some of the stores are on lunch break. Ooh, it looks like it's open. Alright, I'm not really dressed very nice, but look hey, he's like so sharp. That is cute little like polo shirt that I got him. When did I get that? Yes. It was like a while ago and he's got his like dress shorts on. Can't really see, he looks really nice. And then I'm here in my tank top and my shorts. I just picked you up on the beach. Mm -hmm. I gotta look all nice to get me a little beach girl. You're my cabana boy. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Dressed up cabana boy. Yeah, yeah. Um, so we're gonna head out to go to dinner. Nothing fancy, obviously. I'm not dressed for fancy. It's just too hot to get all done up. Um, and I haven't showered. It's a lot After, easier for guys to get dressed up. Well, and you've been at home for two and a half hours, yeah, so. Know. Yeah, I figured you didn't answer your phone for a long time. I know, I was, yeah, yeah. Uh, The girls did not want to go out tonight. Even when I was like, I don't know what to give you for dinner. I was like, we can go to Macaroni Grill. Everyone will find something there. And every one of them was like, nope, I want a night in. I want to watch a movie. I want to have sodas. I want ice cream. I want to, nothing. And I was like, that's fine. So I said, I oh, can pick you up chicken nuggets on our way home. And they were like, yeah, please. <laughs> like they were so excited. So we can do that? Yeah. Okay. Cause they'll be hungry later tonight. Kaylee and Abby are going to make a Caesar salad. Chelsea already made a salad. And I told everyone to leave Ashley alone and she'll find something. There's plenty of food there for her to eat. She just needs to go and find it. Chelsea even cut up carrots into tiny little chunks and sprinkled them on her salad. She's such a girl. Um, so we're going to try to go to dinner at, shoot, what was it called? Kahuna's? No. Hurry quick, the battery's flashing. Big Kahuna's? Big Kahuna's. We're going to Big Kahuna. Hopefully. Looks like there was a car accident. We've been trying to figure out why it would take an hour to go 22 miles, and this is why. This is island style. It's only two lanes, one each direction, so you slow down. We found big kahunas. I, I think we lost our table, but it doesn't look terribly busy. So I think we're gonna have a great view over here. We'll get some seafood for dinner. I'm looking up from my window. Sun's coming up like the day before. You're like a stone on my pillow. I don't make a sound when I shut the door. Good food. Definitely local bar pub no, setting. It's a nice old, nice old. Yeah. yeah. So, oh, is it already gone? So I, I think I filmed it, but Paul Allen's yacht is out here in the water right beyond this little. Former Paul Allen, might be a sister now. Yeah, <laughs> former Paul Allen. And uh, has a helicopter on the top Some of the boat. Some local told us that they, he owned a place out on this point here. Yeah. And he would helicopter from there to the house. To the house. Because you know, 
you know, a that's little, what, you know, dinghy is just not too cool good enough. Yeah, not good enough. Too commoner. But while we were just paying and, and getting um, done, the boat just all of a sudden like oh, wait, turned it's there, around. Over there. It's oh, there. I don't know if I'll be able to. Around again. We'll go up around the corner here and we'll see if we can show it to you again. But uh, so anyway. You know, claim to fame, we saw Paul Allen's boat. Bye. Now we're just gonna walk around Kona um, without the kids for a little bit. It's got a nice little nightlife yeah. restaurant scene. We can spend all day in bed. I'll put the TV in the room. We'll have a Netflix marathon. KG saxophone. We'll order in a bunch of food. All right, so I got this cool bracelet. I don't know if you can see it on the camera. I don't know if you, oh, there you go. A little you bit see of that. that? That's like catching the light. It looks like it's just in there, but it's more the light. So tell them what it is again. I don't remember what it is. So it's some sort of gemstone that has uh, a mermaid. Reflex, mermaid stuff. So that color you're seeing isn't like permanently there. It, it bounces light around. It's yeah. really cool. Really cool. And then you want to open this up? Yeah. So we got this for one of our employees. Got a little spice rub for meats and seafood. She kind of likes to cook and stuff, yeah. so yeah. We're gonna make a little basket of stuff to give her because she literally made this trip possible. <laughs> yeah. Alright, 